no irresponsible youth has a future. Joseph never needed supervision to deliver any given task. And you saw how Joseph was enthroned at the end. In the prison, he took responsibility. Responsibility makes an individual a value-adding citizen of the earth. A great tomorrow is activated by a sense of responsibility today. Go this time and take responsibility over the vision of your life, if you have any. If you haven't found your bearing in life, take time to find your bearing in life and then begin to invest to actualize in it. Responsibility is the price for greatness. No one ever arrives at a future is not prepared for. Life is not a guess adventure. It's an adventure of reality. You can't find yourself in a future you are not prepared for. Wake up. Take responsibility. Every achievement in life must be personally actualized or is fake. A great certificate does not guarantee a great future. There are many products of Harvard University today that have no footprint on the street where they live. So it's not about the school you are coming out from. It's about your disposition to being a responsible citizen. Wake up and take responsibility. Budget your life and budget your time. What am I going to do this number of weeks to add value to my life and prepare for the future that I desire? You don't sit up today, you can't stand out tomorrow. Go about today playing all over town. You become a play man tomorrow. Just walking about. Um, where can I go now? I need to go somewhere. Okay, to do what? No, nothing. Just need to go somewhere. I need to drive out now. Where is the best way to go, right? I'm going to be here. Because his life is not budgeted. His time is not budgeted. So it's just freelance. Anybody can take responsibility to beautify his life. Responsibility will keep you focused, make you diligent, and engrace you to sacrifice in the pursuit of a given task. You got a bright vision, or how are you prepared to actualize the vision? How much knowledge are you acquiring towards accomplishing your vision? What steps are you taking? You fail because you choose to ignore what makes a man succeed. You succeed because you choose to subscribe to the demands of success. You have nobody to blame, not even the devil. When you do what success demands, you have committed God to establish your success. It's a covenant keeping God. Please budget your seasons so you don't end up in regrets. I can tell you this, take responsibility. Don't just have a balloon vision of supermarket. What do you know about supermarket? How many case studies do you have? Have you taken any case study in Nigeria so you can be close to the environment? That's how to do it. So it's not just about catching a vision. It's about walking the vision. It's about running with the vision. Many of you have very grand vision, but you won't take response to find out how to actualize them. So they remain balloon visions. Somebody will run a major supermarket tomorrow. We have a proper knowledge of how it works. Have a proper knowledge of what it takes to make it work. Have a proper knowledge to find appropriate officers. To work there. If it means going to work in one for six months, for one year, for two years, to equip yourself. A BSc entrepreneurial studies does not qualify you for that. You need the specific knowledge of retail business. As we have often said, assumption is the mother of frustration. Please take responsibility. Any vision that is void of knowledge will not see the light of day. So please wake up and take responsibility.